Police, stay where you are. Stand still. Stand still or you're going to get tasered. Taser, taser, taser. On police, put the gun down. Put the gun down now. Attention. Shots fired. Vehicle phone stop southbound on the mic 1-3. Uh, Alongside the vehicle now. Attack contact, attack contact, vehicle spun. Hey guys, it's your boy Dedo McGee and welcome back to another video of LSPDFR. Today we're doing the um, night shift um, out here in the Los Santos County part of the map. Um, and we're gonna... All right, we're going to be using this um, Mitsubishi Outlander today. Um, it's quite nice for uh, this sort of rural part of the map. If we need to go do a little bit of off-roading, um, but it's also just um, not a bad vehicle to be in. Uh, it's night shift today of course and it is the um, season to be spooky so I'm sure there'll be plenty of Halloween antics going on this weekend tonight included so sit back uh, enjoy and um, let's get started before we do get into the um, the meat of today's video though I do just want to do a quick shout out for um, Opus Officer Pope and uh, Ben H for Grammar Police and Immersive Dispatch um, I think someone asked me off a previous video how I get the um, the, the voice commands to work uh, and it's using those two fantastic plugins and quite awkwardly I'd forgotten to put them in the um, in the uh, the document attached to all of my videos uh, to give credit to those guys so um, Opus, Ben, Officer Pope sorry it's in there now um, and if any of you guys are out there playing LSPDFR and you don't have either or both of these plugins as I do um you, you you really should there's there's nothing cooler than actually being able to speak to the game as it were and um have it uh, interact with what you're saying so I'm um, definitely going to check those plugs out um but without any further ado let's um let's get going officers report a suspect on the run oh crikey Someone's escaped. Um, jumped out of a moving transport vehicle. How, though? How have they done that? Oh, it's up here. Okay. Oh, that's slippy. Oh. Let me out, let me out. Suspect heading southbound on Marlow Drive. Dispatch, I've got one running. Stop! 1080 on Marlow Drive. Stop! Stop, dude, you're gonna get Roger, sprayed. Backup required. Copy that, dispatch. We'll find those animals. Let's... What? I've got so many questions. How the hell has he managed to get out of a van and a set of handcuffs? I... I'm... I'm at a loss. Like, the van shouldn't be able to be open from the inside. And he should be in handcuffs. I guess they didn't put him in handcuffs. But he's already dressed as a convict. I'm very, very confused. Right, you know what? Buddy, you just hold up there. Um, can someone watch him? Hi. In fact, you know what? Buddy, I'm assuming you're already on, under arrest. So I'm just going to search you anyway to see... If he's got like a lock pick or something, I'm in mean, like what? Pocket map of LS Metro, selfie stick, downtown Cadley for an immigration document in different names. Okay, so but nothing he can use to get out of handcuffs or anything. I'm, I can't search the back of this van because it won't let me. Um, can I? No, I can't ask them anything. Right. Well, I guess. We just get him back in. He's in handcuffs now, so hopefully. A 
we can just not have him escape. That cough sounds nasty, mate. You should probably do a probably do a test for that. All right, okay. Very bizarre one for the first one of the day, and um, I, I, you know what? We're just gonna we're just gonna get the hell out of here. That was weird. That was very random. High traffic. Requesting a moving vehicle check. Uh, let's see, Echo Oscar 1 2 Bravo Golf Foxtrot. Bravo's got a suspended Echo license. Ocean, one, two, boy, George Frank. A traffic felony. Approach with caution. Show me on a stop. Mario Velotti. Uh, I would tell you how many times it's occupied, but I don't know. I can't really see. Right, let's just try and stop him on this side bit here. Uh, look at that, it's worked. That was actually quite good. Right, let's have a look. Okay, so, uh, vehicle record. It's the BF injection. Tax is valid, insurance is valid, and it's not listed as stolen. Close, not applicable. All right. Uh, owner record, Mario Velotti, he's 19 years old from Mirror Park Boulevard. Not wanted, but he is disqualified. Alright, okay, let's um, let's see. Go back. Requesting a traffic unit. 10-4, copy yeah. that. Backup required what? in, uh... That was Great interesting. Temporal. Right, let's get out and have a copy chat. Six, Body worn on. And let's have a look. This does look, indeed look like Mario. Um, evening. Seems to be nervous. I wonder why. Um, oh, I, need to, I still need to add in a, a thing for hello. Uh, fine. Uh, just let you know the body camera is recording. Okay, good. Um, why is my car showing red light at the front? That's interesting. Uh, reason I've pulled you over today, buddy, is on our system it's showing that you have got a suspended license. I, I definitely can stop you, buddy, um, especially if um, if you're disqualified. Go ahead and hop out. Hold on a sec. And you know what? Come over here. We'll get you out out the road first. Oh, buddy, you got your, your driver's license on ID, you. Huh? Thank you. This is indeed Mario. Okay. Mario, turn around and put your hands behind your back. You're under arrest for driving whilst disqualified. You don't have to say anything, but it may harm your defence if you do not mention one question, something which you later rely on in court. Anything you do say you may be given in evidence. Do you understand the caution I just read to you? Hey, hey, you're the one that decided you wanted to, um, to drive whilst suspended, not me, okay? Alright, buddy, you're gonna be searched under section 32 of pace. Have you got anything I've gone past search. Have you got anything on you? Hang on. I'm gonna search you under section 32 of pace. Can't search without probable cause. This isn't America, buddy. This isn't America. And my probable cause is the fact that you're under arrest, if we really want to go into that. Um, anything illegal on you I should know about. Not answering any questions about you, Lord. Fine, absolutely fine. Let's uh, let's have a quick search. Holy balls. A postcard, a letter, a Glock 19 pistol, that escalated quickly, and a pack of mints, back down again. Alright, okay. Um, tell you what we're going to do. We're going to get... Um, 
We're going to let traffic get out of here. And instead, what we're going to do, we're going to get ARV uh, to come and deal with this Glock. Why are they spawning next to the car then going further away? That's very weird. Right, he's been searched, so... Uh, don't, dude, don't, don't step away from me. Let's not do that. And let's put him in, in the rear seat for now. Right, just sit tight for me, buddy, alright? It's a symphony of sirens. Well, ARV is single crewed. That's unexpected. Oh, well, buddy, I'm going to bring this Glock around to the back of your car. With a weird light on top. And... I'm just going to run the um, run the serial through. It has got a serial number, so... It's valid. And it's registered to him. Somehow. Don't know how that works. With a Section 5 firearm with a man that doesn't have a... Um, have a weapons license. But alright, that's in the back of the um, um, ARV gun safe now. So now we're going to have a quick look uh, at the vehicle. Little diddy car this, so not much to search. And we've got a deflated balloon, suburban diff uh, gift card, a stick of chewing gum, a note about making various deliveries overnight, uh, a leather jacket, several rubbish bags, a set of number plates, a CD labelled panty picks. The set of number plates is interesting. Um, uh, I wish there was a way for me to check um, the other set of number plates. I might add that into a set of questions. Ask about another set of number plates and actually scan the number plates, if you know what I mean. Um, but okay, nothing, nothing too horrendous. This is gonna have to be towed because mm, no, I'm, I'm not just gonna leave it out in the middle of nowhere. Requesting recovery. And just a flatbed will do fine. Flatbed. Assistance required in Great Right, Pepper. okie dokie. Right, ARV, you can take off. And now we're going to get our third set of backup for this job in requesting a van. I need some damn backup, man! Backup needed in Great Chaparral. Roger. We're over now. Oh, I should have just pushed G, shouldn't I? That would have been better, wouldn't it? Uh, to ask him. This is very loud. Right, buddy, what's the deal with the, um... Do you have a valid permit for this? That that didn't really answer the question. Um, where did you get this? Uh, fine, okay. Well, he doesn't want to answer any of our questions on that, so you guys can um, get rid of this chap. Assistance required in Great Chaparral. Scum! Well, I wouldn't go that far. He's a bit of a plum, but... Right, let's do this very quickly. So, we're going to have... It's quite a simple one, this one. Um, he's going to have weapons. It's possession of a Section 5 firearm. Oh, that tick. Yes, it did. And traffic, uh, driving whilst disqualified. And that is, um, yeah, that's essentially it. So, submit them. Beautiful. He's going to hop into the back. Oh, steady, steady. And there we go. He's in. Closed door. Thanks. And that is, as they say, that. So, um, that's that. And, um, let's get back out there, shall we? Night is young. What happened?
Oh, that's what happened. He crashed. Requesting moving vehicle check. Uh, Delta Sierra 15 Lima Hotel uh, Sierra. It's a rapid GT2. Jessica Anderson. David, Sam, one, Mrs. Anderson. Henry, Sam, okay, let's um. Uh, Jessica Anderson. She's got previous four illegal window tint. Is an, an escaper and parking on a footpath. Other than that, no problems at all. Um. See what's the uh, what the issue is. Hello. Um. I wish there was just an option for. Are you okay? I mean. Um. Just hop hop out for me. Turn turn the engine off. Fantastic. And just just come with me o over here, just so we're uh, out the road. Okay. Right. <clears throat> Wait a sec, buddy. Uh, what's your name, please? Let's see some ID, huh? Thanks. Okay, it's Jessica, and it's her car. Right, just uh, let's have a look. It's um. I mean, the window's absolutely gone, and uh, as is the bumper. So I don't really know how she's managed to do this. Um. Let's, uh, uh, do, 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 vehicle. Explain to me how the crash happened. You weren't paying attention. Okay, well, you've you've got a completely flat tire, so you really need to get this towed. Um, um because it's an RTC, we'll just get um, has to take a breath test. Let's take a breath test. You don't want to take a br breathalyzer, okay? In particular, well, why not? Um, if you don't, you you could be arrested for failure to provide. You're going to do it? Sure, okay, thank you. There's no reason why not. Unless you, of course, you are drunk. Just blow into this. Keep going. Blow, 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 blow. Thank you. And it's zero. Thank you very much. Okay. So, what we'll suggest is... Um, She's she's not actually committed a crime. Crashing your car is not a crime. Um, she hasn't caused any damage to any road furniture. So it's literally just single car RTC with damage only to her own vehicle. So there's no crime there. But she can't drive it like this. So what we're going to do, I'm going to arrange for your car to be towed. Alright? Uh, do I have a thing about that? Let me see. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh... A, I'll, I'll, I'll use it this one. Okay, so your vehicle's gonna ha have to be towed. Um, do you have your own recovery? All right, there's, 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 there's no need to be like that. How about, yeah? Do you want someone to come up and pick it up? No. Right. Well, I'm gonna arrange recovery. In fact, no. If that's her saying no, she doesn't want to re arrange her own re recovery. That's fine. So you can go now if you want, um, but you can't drive the car. Based on that, do you want me to call a taxi for you? Please. Okay, oh, I can do that. Requesting a taxi. So we're going to get this lady a taxi. Um, and she wants to leave her car here. It's mm, not in a particularly dangerous place. It's mostly off the road. I'm just going to get it slightly further off the road. There we go. There you go. She's got her keys back. She's going to go get in a taxi. And... The job is a good one. So, um, nice and simple one. Again, very strange. Lots of strangeness already today. We've had people jumping out of locked cages they shouldn't get. People crashing their own car for apparently no reason. It's, um, it's all very strange. But anyway, let's, um, let's continue, shall we? All units, we have an 11351 in Tampa Valley. Show me towards. 10 4 copy. X ray. Victor 2 5. 
Right, a car fire. That um, sounds a little bit suspicious at this time of night. Hopefully there's no one in it. Um, but we'll get down there and... Oh, it's literally just at the bottom of this hill, actually. But we'll um, we'll get down there, call for fire, and um, hopefully sort it out. As I say, I hope there's, there's no one in it. If there is, then that will be really bad. Um, is this police unit in front going to go help or not? They're also not being very helpful at all. Get out of the way! Come on, move. It's quite foggy. This lights are very bright in the fog. Uh, up here, is it? No, get out of the way. Right, just around here. Oh, careful! I see a car. Oh, there, that, it, it be that. Requesting fire and rescue. We're just gonna back up a tiny bit here. Body cam on. Right, ah, no, no, don't run past it. I want the fire extinguisher. Oh God! Oh, it's okay for fire here anyway. Requesting another unit. Now oh, look in there. Requesting a traffic unit. That's it. Oh, cool. so put it out. Uh, I'm not seeing anyone in the car. I hope. I think that's just a seat. I'm hoping that's just a seat. Right, they've, 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 they they appear to have got this. Um, they're doing their thing. I'm going to put this away. Uh, store fire extinguisher. Cool. Right, and what we're going to do... Oh, trafficker here. What I'm going to do is we're going to grab... some cones, so I'm going to start it about there, I think. So here, and then we're going to come around the front here. Dispatch to, um, X-ray, Victor, two, five, check up. And then probably, we're going to keep it contained within here, and we're just going to put the other one over there. Sweet! Get rid of that. You can cancel checks. Victor, two, five, ten, four, copy that. Right, um, well the good news is there is no one in it. Um, we're going to have a quick look, see if we can find a... Oh no, we have got a number plate. Uh, Papa Bravo, one, two, Kilo, Romeo, Foxtrot, I believe. Requesting a vehicle check. Roger that, transport no, required. No, didn't, didn't ask for transport. Requesting a vehicle PNC check. Really? Okay, you know what? We're not gonna we're, we're just gonna we're just gonna do this. Uh, it's an F six twenty. Who knows what colour it was Car once upon a time. Belongs to Carl Davidson. King, Robert Frank. Target is ten four. Uh da -da 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 vehicle. Uh was originally green at one point. Oh my goodness grief. Well Ms. Davidson is 55, lives on Elgin Avenue, down in the city. Uh, she's had an expired driver's license for about, what, four months? Um, she's got an arrest warrant for production of Class B. Um, and she's got previous arrest for possession of a firearm by a prohibited person. Uh, stalking. Rape. Not quite sure how that works, but... Um, and possession of a bladed article in a public place. Um... Oh, okay. Uh, she's got a marker for impersonates female, so... I don't know if that means she's... It's actually a... Kyle is indeed a man? And that would also explain how that one's possible, but, um... Okay. 
Right, well, either way, no, we're not going to leave this here. We're going to get this recovered, I think. Um, so, requesting recovery. And, yeah, just a f it's going to have to be a flatbed. It's not going to get dragged anywhere. Dear, oh dear. Well, I'm glad there's no one, um, there's no one with it. In, in some regards, because it means they're okay. Are we over a waterfall here? That would be quite ironic. Can you hear cascading water? Oh no, I think we're just near the river. Oh no, it is there, look. Pretty. Um, there, there, there might be a tow truck coming from that direction, to be honest. I can't see. What we're going to do, um, we're going to... Uh, clear the traffic control, but we're just going to slow it down. How about that? And then I'm going to get out of the way of this car. Hopefully traffic is sensible as well and does the same. Uh, here's the tow truck. Please don't hit my car. And there it goes. Right. Okay. Uh, buddy, thank you very much for coming out and helping me out with this. Um, although it is your... Um, no, I didn't want to convert him to a partner, did I? Need he can, backup. he can, he can go. Right, we're gonna um, clear up some of this tape, and um, and then we'll get back out there. Okay, so we're making our way into Sandy Shores now. It's the um, the upper end of the area we cover. Um, to reports of a disturbance. Um, no further details than that, actually. Um, just a disturbance of some kind. So. We'll see what we've got. Um, that looks like it's going to be just here. Is this person okay? Uh, right, okay. Dispatch, show me on scene. Roger that, 10, 23. Requesting another unit. Copy that. Backup required in okay. Grande Sonora Desert. Alright, buddy, it's the police. Hello. Victor 13. Hello. Currently heading to the location. No. Aliens, they're everywhere. They're starting the invasion. Right. Where do you see them? There and there and there and over there and in the sky. Everywhere. Okay, there are no aliens. Uh, no, 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 okay. Hold up. Dude, dude, buddy, 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 buddy. Dispatch, I've got one running. Buddy! Shall we not? Right, I don't... Unfortunately, this is the only way that I can, um... Get him to stop is by... Pointing something at him. It's... Oh, it's gonna get hit! Buddy! Buddy! Ah. Uh. Buddy, just stop running! Stop running into the road! Right, okay, buddy, just chill. Right. Ah. <sighs> Right, we're gonna have to do this because if we just dismiss him, then that breaks um well everything. But Hi. right, buddy, step this way. Right. I think this guy's having oh. some kind of um mental health crisis. Uh, I think it's fair to say either that or he's taken some drugs. We can ask him all of that. Uh, appreciate you, buddy, for turning up and uh, helping. Um, assuming he's a local team from up here, but um. Let's get this guy back over to where we found him by the car in the light as well, um, and um, just basically see if he's o okay. Because at the minute, I'm I'm thinking he's possibly not. But um, mate, you've you, you've parked your car kind of goofy, so you might want to um, might want to fix that. Right, okay, buddy. God damn. All right, all right, just hold up. Don't don't go anywhere. Just just hold on. Doesn't seem to want to. Right. Okay. Shit. Way 
Wait a sec, buddy. Right. Okay. So let's. Oh, buddy. Um, have you done any drugs recently? Get your supervisor. No, we don't need us a supervisor at, at, at the minute. What is it you're doing out here? Am I being detained? Just, just at the minute, we're just having a chat, buddy. Let's um. Just, why did you run? Okay, that's fine. Right. Um, mental health. Are uh, Are you okay? No. Okay. Okay. If I get a mental health specialist out here, you are you going to want to speak to them? Yeah. Cool. Um. That's been stolen. That's no bueno. Um. I do want to go to this. Uh, have you used any drugs at all recently? Some pills. I don't know what they were. I found them in a bathroom. Right. Okay. Do you have any of these drugs on you still? Right, okay, that's fine. Because you seem like you might be under the influence of something. So, right, but what we're going to do, just turn around for, for, for me. We're just going to, I'm just going to pat you now, make sure you've not got anything else on you. Um, that maybe you, you shouldn't have, or any of these pills that are causing you some, some issues. Um, nope. Two sets of car keys, but... Um, that's all interesting. Um, let's see if he wants to give us his name. What's your name, buddy? He does give us his name, so we'll... Let's see if he's got any history or markers for mental health. No, he's been stop searched before. Uh, and a ticket for driving in a bus lane. I'll tear you apart. We're, we're, we're not going to be tearing anyone apart. Um, right, you know what, buddy? You can take off. Thanks for coming out, but we're we're, we're okay. We, we we really are. We're going to get this guy a. Um, we're going to get this guy a um, an ambulance. Just get a medic out here. Give him the once over. Make sure he's okay. To be honest, the way he's speaking to me now, maybe he is all right. But you can never really be too sure, so. Hey guys, this is Mr. West. Um, he's complained about seeing aliens and then run off from me. He has also said he's had some pills and possibly some tabs tonight, so. Hold on a sec. No, no, I didn't want to speak to anyone. It's okay. Oh, that's, yep. Yeah. You surf that, buddy. Alright, well, okay, that's, um. Hopefully, Mr. West is going to be okay. Um. But we'll let um, medical professionals do their thing, and we'll, we're we're going to get get out of here. All right, guys, we've got an abandoned triple nine. Someone's called in saying there are people at his front door with um, weapons trying to get in, uh, and then the line's gone dead. He's just hung up on us. So we're going to go over there, make sure he's all right. Um, if there's anyone else, obviously deal with them. We have got another unit that's um, going to follow us up. So. Uh, should be okay, even if there's a couple of people there. We've um, at least we've got someone with us. It's just up here at this cabin. Oh, I see someone. Hello, has he got a? You coming? Hello? That's a bat. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hey, buddy. Whoa, um. I see that, no, no, you don't. No, you do not. Right, you. Put it down. Attention, all units. Put it down. Shit. Come back here. Damn it, I missed him. Buddy, put it down. You're gonna get tased. Tase, taser. Stop. Wait a sec, buddy. Stop. Put it down. Put it down. 
Put it down. Right, at this moment in time, you're under arrest for a fray in position of an offensive weapon. You don't have to say anything, but it may harm your defence if you do not mention one question, something which you later rely on in court. Anything you do say may be given in evidence. Do you understand? We'll ask him the questions. We'll um, we'll walk back over there and then we'll um, we'll deal with this. Right. Okay. Right. I'm assuming this guy's under arrest as well. Nice. Right. First, first good question, buddy. Do you understand the um, the caution I read to you? You didn't. I didn't mean to do it. You didn't mean to do what? Like, what? What did you do? I did. Okay. Why would you say that? Get what over with? Okay. And why did you run from me? Refuse to answer any questions. Right, okay. Tell you what. You just kneel down there. Alright, what about... Where are you? Why are you out here? They slept with your wife? Who did? Okay. Right, um... But if you're just alright, I'm going to see if there's, um... Where the aggrieved party's at. See if we've got a victim for this, uh... Uh, for this incident. Hello? I can't see you in any of these windows. Hello? Oh, shit! Oh, crap. Um, get me an ambulance. Ambulance. Um, tend to injure Pedro. Is this guy okay? I'm not... Oh, it looks like we're going to try doing some C CPR here. Oh, shit. He's... It's alright. Well, ambulance is on, on, on route, so... Yeah, guys, we're through here. Show me on scene. Should have done that earlier, shouldn't I? Oh, they're going to go around that way, are they? Yeah, around here, guys. Are you alright uh, over there, mate? Just... Hopefully this dude's okay. So... One guy had a machete, I think. The other guy had a baseball bat. I'm not entirely sure, actually. Oh. Oh, dear. Right, well. Next time. Well, then. Always a next time. Right, okay, I'm speaking to the both of you now. At this moment in time, you're both further under arrest on suspicion of murder. You do not have to say anything, but it may harm your defence if you do not mention one question, something which you later rely on in court. Anything you do say may be given in evidence. Shot by handgun. I'm not sure. Okay. We're just going to, um... I need some damn we're just going to get a van out here. Required in Great Chaparral. Right, buddy, get up. You gotta get searched. Haven't done that yet. Knows about meeting in the hills this evening. Right, that further cements... I don't know why I clapped there. That <laughs> further cements the idea that this is um, murder. That guy said that um, he slept with his wife. This is his mate. He's got the note about meeting in the hills this evening. This all seems pre-planned to me. Uh, no, not that, sorry. Search. And a another note about meeting in the hills this evening. Um, condom, hand lotion, postcard. Multiple photos of young girls is just plain weird in any sense. Especially when it's on a clown. Uh, and some safe keys. Right, buddy. What's your name? He's given his name and ID. And same question for you. What's your name? 
He doesn't want to say anything. Okay. Yeah, I see you. Right, we're going to... No. I want the clown. Right, we're going to take him. Get him in the van. Right. You're good. Go. Let's get him in here. The hell? No, we're not leaving that open. Right, let's um while we're here, let's have a look to see. Um, oh. X-ray Victor 2 5. Check up. Oh, this guy's got an arrest warrant for taking without consent. This is clown number one. And he's got an arrest warrant for manslaughter. Well, guess what? He's going to have another one. So, this guy will put arrest warrant for Twok, which I think is going to be under traffic. Uh, no? Oh, no, it's under theft. My bad. Um, uh, it's going to be straight up murder and uh, possession of an offensive weapon. Um... So, submit. And this other guy. Go West War Hunt for manslaughter. Good grief. Um, weapons also presents an offensive weapon. And then a homicide. It's going to be the murder and an attempted murder. Good lord. We've picked up a couple of right winners this evening. And we're going to get another van out here. Assistance needed in Great Chaparral. Oh dear. Green two, we're in the area. Right, you're right with him. Oh no. Dispatch to um X-ray oh. Victor two five check up. You can cancel checks. Cancel checks. Uh, other vans here now. Victor cool. two, five, ten, four. <sighs> Requesting forensics. This poor guy. Assistance required in uh Great Chaparral. Right, let's get this other guy away. Oh dear. I'm, I'm, I'm not even going to speak to him. I'm not going to ask him anything about this. This is a serious case. It's um, uh, a murder. And so we're not going to ask him anything um, until he's um, sat in an interview and under caution. Um, so let's, let's get him in here. And we'll clear up some space for uh, forensics to get in. Right, that's, that's that done. Let's get both of these guys away. Two suspects in separate vehicles. Hopefully they don't do anything funky. Right, the CSIs have cleared up. And so I think that's just about us. We're going to hail a lift back to the station and um, do, some, um, do some writing, I think. And uh, so I'll see you back there. Right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. It's been a little bit of a manic Halloween-esque night shift, um, but um, we've made it through as always. So thank you all so very much for watching. Do not care about that bolo right now because I am going home. Um, <laughs> so I say thank you all so very much for watching. Remember, stick around to the end of the video to see all the outcomes um, for today's incident, and I will see you back on patrol.